When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done. All the good times just begun. We know what we have, let's hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy, but things are finally right With you and I, the future is bright Happy Monday Happy from Monday. Oregon! Oh, yes, yes. Oh, we got our yes. delivery done this morning in Washington. We are delivered and dead heading down south to yeah. California. Don't have a load yet, but hopeful. <laughs> Goodness. We stopped Stop. at this rest area Stop. and they've been running around. She's Stop. all excited. Stop. Calm down. <laughs> oh. Calm down, you creepazoid. I know. So yeah, no calls for anything. Nothing's no. really been coming across the Qualcomm either. Well, on the west uh, west coast, a bunch of stuff on the east coast. Yeah, yeah. All for like that next week, I think. Doesn't but help us. No. <laughs> no, that ain't gonna help us no. none, so. Man, it's cold up here. I love it. He yeah, does love that. it. He's still in shorts, shorts, no jacket. No jacket. Flip flop. No. Oh, no, you don't got, you got your regular shoes on. Stop. What Stop. you guys think? Tyson said Stop. it's cold too. He thinks it's Stop. cold. And she's like, it's cold. I'm ready to go back to the truck. <laughs> I'm ready to go I mean, back it to is the beautiful, though. Gosh, I love the Pacific Northwest. That KOA we stayed in last night was nice. Oh, yeah. We, yeah, it was pretty cool staying at KOA. It, it was like $50 to stay there for the night. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, sure, more than we, we would have paid at the truck stop, but we had the amenities, too. Right. So. The shore power, the yeah. water, the, yeah. R, the RV dump. Yeah. And... Didn't have to run the generator, all yeah. that good stuff. So, yeah. yeah, that was worth it for me. Jason grilled a tri-tip last night. I Turned did. Out, mm, so good. Delicio. So good. Yeah, it was good. Man, I hope we get one load for for uh, this week. Yeah. Yeah, I really do. Uh, we'll see. Hopefully. I mean, it's Monday. It's usually always kind of quiet on Mondays, so I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, we'll see. We may get and lucky. We may not. We may be sitting in California all weekend, weekend, weekend. Yeah. Will may, you stop, please? Maybe spending Thanksgiving in California. <laughs> <laughs> These fools, I'm telling you. I know. Well, you can hear him making noises. She's shivering because I think she's cold. She's They're like, both cold. Yeah. I'm cold. We're all cold like except for Daddy's the only one that's not cold. I know. <laughs> Golly, man. But, uh, um, yeah, we're in, I don't even know where in Oregon we are. I'm on the like I-5 200-some miles from the border of California. Yeah, something like that. So We're just going to keep driving. I don't where. How far are we going to go into California? I don't know. We you got an hour and a half left on your time. Then yeah. I get a well. She's got more than that, but then I get a 34 in that time. So then we'll swap to my time. Yeah. And then I'll just drive until I get tired or just don't want to drive no more. Yeah, because before we picked up the load coming out here, I had got a 34 and Jason didn't. Yeah. So and I only got like 20 hours. Yeah. So we tried to use most of my more of my time on the way out here, and yeah. then we just went ahead and I started my time this morning for to do the delivery, so he could get a 34 even though we'll start gaining hours tonight no, but was, not many i was going to gain like 47 minutes tonight yeah two hour two and a half hours tomorrow just not enough to keep yeah. keep going so yeah yeah so but of course we do this <clears> and then we won't need it we'll be sitting and <laughs> that's how it always happens that's how it works <laughs> oh my gosh. yeah but anyway yeah. yeah well let's get these babies inside we're cold yeah let's continue on and we'll catch up and keep See you what guys happens. posted yep. yeah yeah all right let's go let's go let's go go go. <laughs> go for it go for it jump jump come on abby <laughs> <laughs> Happy Tuesday from Lodi, California. So uh, we are at the Flying J. Maybe a little noisy around here, but we uh, got here, gosh, 
two, like three, three in the morning. In the morning. <laughs> yeah, six o'clock in the morning or five o'clock in the morning our time. <laughs> so yeah, we, we, we slept in a little bit today, but we are getting up, getting around, getting projects done, yeah. figuring out what we're gonna do. We wanna show you something because this is something that when you're doing your pre-trip, you should check this because we've had this happen to us on our last truck and now this truck. And Dave's truck. Yeah, three times. Three times yeah. we've had this happen, so. Yeah, so the muffler, or the exhaust, <laughs> muffler. not a muffler, the <laughs> exhaust on the truck, it comes down, let me show you. This is the Big. exhaust pipe. Yep. And there is a U-bracket that holds the exhaust pipe up, which you can see there. But if you look, see this bolt? Well, there's supposed to be one here. That one broke off. It broke. So we have a replacement. Yeah. This, it, this is something I actually had in, had on hand because we yeah. had extras from the last time. Yeah. It's a $7 part from Freightliner. Yeah. Really inexpensive. Super cheap. Not a bad thing to have on hand because no. this thing can break at any time. I mean, it just happens because of the vibration, the road, you know, yeah. it, it happens. It's, yeah something to but something to watch out for when you're doing your pre-trips we're gonna go ahead and change it real quick yeah. and uh just show you how easy it is so let me get my fat butt under there <laughs> well this is gonna be easy since one of the bolts is broken off so we only have to take <laughs> one off uh, it is gonna be a 14 millimeter I love these ratchet wrenches. Where'd you get those? Uh, Walmart. Was those Walmart ones? I think so, or like AutoZone or something. One they're, of those prices. yeah, they're a cheap brand, but. Work it, work it. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I think once we're done with this, we're gonna go over to the Blue Beacon, which is right here next door, and get the truck washed. She needs it, she's filthy. Yep, so as you can see right there, it broke right off. Yeah. Again, this. not uncommon. Like, this has been the third one we've replaced on three different trucks. So yeah, yeah. Just ni a nice little part to keep on hand because you don't want to get a DOT inspection and they see something like that. It's, it's funny, we just had a DOT inspection last week too, so. It I, wasn't broken then. It wasn't it, broken no, then, but it, sure enough, it breaks right after the <laughs> DOT inspection. Yeah. Uh, so you stick that in there, you come up through the bottom. Pretty simple stuff here. Yeah, like I said, this was $7 from Freightliner. Looks like we're missing the washer on that side. But the new bolts, see how that's a smooth surface right there? That's the old bolt. That's the old bolt. The new ones have some locking teeth on it, so. One. Two. Put my little lever there so I can go the opposite way. And I am gonna go each side a little bit at a time just to kind of make sure it tightens up even. Yeah, we haven't gotten any calls for any loads yet, which we kind of figured with it being Thanksgiving week. Bada bing, bada boom. Boom. All done. I'm not going to go too crunch, crimp it down too tight because that's probably why it broke before. Yeah. Being too tight and the bouncing and moving and it's on there so it's locked and we will keep an eye on this every pre-trip we do going forward just to make sure everything's safe yeah, on it. Yeah, something you should check, be checking anyway when you're doing your pre-trip. This is a pretty easy item to fix on your, your Yeah, own, easy yeah. to do it yourself. Don't yeah. pay a shop however right. much an hour they charge to do that. <laughs> you can totally do that yourself. Yeah. All right, All right let's get off this piss-filled <laughs> trucker We're on the ground. ground. Yeah. 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 All right, let's go. Before I sleep Hear the crickets See the moon Side by side and through and through No limit to what we can do Oh, we know what we have Let's hold on tight 
Barstow, California. Yep. Yep. We deadheaded all the way from Washington to Barstow. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What was that like? 1,300 miles, I think. Yeah. And That's we right. did not get a load. No Tomorrow's load. Thanksgiving. Yep. So it looks like we're going to probably be here till next week. All week. We yep. did get a call last night. We did. It was. Uh, yeah. It wasn't. Was it something we it wanted wasn't, to do? Yeah. It wasn't very good at all no it and the potential to have to sit on it until monday uh was big yeah. it was really big so it was not uh not worthy of doing definitely mm -mm. not worth it so no i'm cold it's windy here it's like in the 60s but that wind oh my gosh yeah it's, yeah <sighs> i love our side because of that <laughs> we that's were, why we always come up here it's one do. of our favorite spots and and we, yeah, we stopped yesterday. We stopped and we got some shocks for the truck because we figured if we're going to be sitting, it's time to replace them. So we're, nice. we'll do that. We stopped at Trader Joe's and got groceries. So we are stocked and got stuff to make Thanksgiving dinner tomorrow. We are going to cook. Which see in the next vlog. Yeah, we're going to cook a whole Thanksgiving feast in the truck. Yeah. Uh, we're going to do about chicken. A I don't know about a whole feast, it's but... It's going to be a pretty good for the two for of the us, two of you us. know? Yeah, we got a whole chicken instead of a turkey. Yeah. You got... You're going to do green beans. Green beans and a cauliflower mushroom. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So... We're going to make that It's going to be a nice feast for us, and yeah, it should be pretty cool. Yeah, and... Uh, make the best of it. Yeah. yeah. We were thinking about going to an RV park, that, and I was like, man, I don't know, I... Do we want to spend the money on that? Which we don't mind doing that. Yeah. But it, we got not, free parking right here. And it's free parking and not having a load lined up. I mean, it is possible we <laughs> could get a call for something out of the blue Friday. It's possible. Tomorrow even. Not likely. Not likely. <laughs> but you just never know. So, yeah, I, yeah we figure we'll just come here because I figure there ain't, it's not going to be very busy here over the holiday. No. And we've got Flying J across the street for the RV dump, water. We got. There's more stuff to do around here if we want to go do something. Not yep. that anything's open because yep. of what's going on. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, no restaurants or nothing. No. But that's, that's fine. But that's why we made sure to stock up on groceries yesterday so we'd have plenty of food for their own. Um, we also actually got to get the batteries checked out. Yesterday we stopped driving around 5, 6 o'clock and then around 10 and 11 o'clock. We went to go start the generator up to cook some food, and the generator wouldn't start. So I had to run around, uh, find somebody to give us a jump, and uh, found a guy in a pickup truck. He came over, and we were able to jump the generator, not the truck, but the generator charges up the battery, so that's it, we did that. But the fact that we weren't able to start the generator only after four or five hours, uh, it, it, it's not normal yeah, you know usually yeah. we can run the thing all night and have no problem at all yeah, so and it's we, something's wrong with them they're under warranty so and i we bought them at a ta so i i got us uh in line here at the shop to uh, get them to actually, look at them or hopefully even replace them for under warranty actually we bought them at a petro petro ta yeah, yeah, yeah same thing um yeah, and, and you need to get in there and recalibrate the generator thing, don't the, you? The auto start, the auto yeah, start. yeah, yeah. Because it should be auto starting if the batteries get 
to a certain level, it should auto start. Actually, you know what? I had shut that off the last time. Yeah, I forgot. Well, that. yeah, go figure. That's then. why it didn't start last <laughs> night. But it still, it should last all night long yeah. and some. You know, yeah. we shouldn't have had that problem because we drove all day yesterday. So batteries should have been been fully charged, no problem at all. So yeah, Very yeah, good. we'll have the TA test them yeah. and probably them out. probably get them uh, replaced. You'll so. find out what happens with that in the next vlog too. I'm sure next we'll tell vlog. you. Yeah. So yeah. yeah, we're gonna end this one here. We'll pick up the next one. See what happens. I'm, I hope we're not sitting here all weekend, but it Hopefully. looks like it. So. Hopefully. <laughs> all right, guys. Thank you, as always, for watching and subscribing. And until our next video. Peace, love, and expediting. Peace, love, and turkey day. <laughs> <laughs>